Hello, hello, and welcome. We're taking a brief break from Souls games, and I'm going to play one of my favorite games from a long, well, a while ago. So I hope you enjoy this. I'm going to do a full playthrough uh, eventually, um, at least, of Sticks 1 and 2. All right, let's get started. It's been a while since I've played this, but pretty excited. The Atrium of Akinash. Oh my gosh, that's loud. A world shut inside another. Turn this down. Yeah, it is so loud. Elves. Oh, you know, I wonder if it's if not you turning know. down for you. They don't need spies to find out it's what's only... going on in this accursed heart of the tree, of course. I knew it. I turned down my headset and I thought and that did it also themselves. for the stream. Father, we must bring them to heal while we still have time. Enough, Aaron. I secured this alliance with the elves and I intend to respect Oh, you're not familiar with this game. Uh Sticks. You know it, it was one of my well. favorite games a long time ago. Oh, yes, you do need the elves. It's a stealth game. How many of you poor little humans died? I beat one for sure, and I don't remember if I beat part two yourselves. back in the day. Wow. Um, I totally agree with you. Stealth games are a hit and miss. So I was surprised when this yeah. caught my attention oh, this a while ago. What? All right, let me fix this I, audio quick. Was I? Shit, my brain is Hopefully this handle. will be better. Yeah, yeah. The heart of the tree. Yeah, the story of this game I do with my dagger? and stuff is kind of cool. I feel naked without my dagger. I gotta find it quick. Well, you can choose to go stealth in this game, or like when I would get impatient, I would just say screw it. It's easier to go stealth, but it, you can get skilled enough to like parry enemies and stuff like that. Um, yeah. Anyways, definitely do not remember how to play. So I should be able to climb up there. Yeah, that was the thing that that got me the the story, and the gameplay. I don't know. I liked it, but normal stealth games, I'm not really a fan of. Can I run? Oh, hello. I think. There we go. I got gotcha. you. Wait, you'd never be. You never get impatient. No, never, man. That's not characteristic of me. Yeah, well, don't get excited. We'll play for it with dice tonight. In the meantime, keep your hands off. Okay, okay. I'll wait till tonight. It's kind of cool because throughout the entire game, you're hearing these uh, voices in your head, and you're trying to figure out where they're coming from. My dagger. It can't be far away. Is that audio better? Can you hear sticks talk? Because that's pretty important. Isle of Life. I should drink this flask. This is an ashen up a little. <laughs> Estus or whatever. Wait, LB to use items? That's weird. Might have to change that or get used to it. Well, more climbing, I guess. Maybe a tiny bit more volume, but it's doable. Okay, sweet. But yeah, there's later on in the game, it really makes you think about things like, do I want to, which direction do I go? And like, I don't know, strategize. Let's see, how do you drop? B to drop. I must stay out of sight until I find my dagger. Crouching moves silently. Can I just walk past him? You get cool abilities and all sorts of stuff. Oh, that's right. I think you can throw sand at these late, later on. Always keep to the shadows and walk where it doesn't make too much noise. Avoid running and farting. Ooh, 
Oop. Wrong button. The world tree. It seems so close. But it's a mirage. It's so big that it seems to be close. But I still got a long way to go. It's a big tree. So, from what I heard, the only access to the heart is a bridge which that two-faced Governor Barryman has had closed off with a tamper-proof lock, and he keeps the only key in his apartments. And as if that wasn't bad enough, the whole area is crawling with elves. I'm gonna have to go down into the prisons and free my... Uh, friend. He knows how to deal with an elf. <laughs> So, if I'm gonna survive in this tower, I'm gonna need somewhere safe. I turned it up a little bit, so hopefully it's well as a map better. Atrium. Well, I'll get nothing done standing around here. I'll get my dagger, and then it's off to work. Subtitles make me read the stuff every time it pops up. But it sounds good. Oh, as in, like, you want to read it or something, or... If I stay under there, I won't be seen. At least you can read it if it's not good. Really? You're just gonna sit there? But good. That's good. Yeah, you can, you can go crazy in this game once you get a dagger. If you get good at parries ah, and, and stuff like there's that. There's my dagger. I was afraid hey. that I lost you, my beauty. Hmm. There we go. There maps of the zone stuck up here. They might be useful. Let's see. We got maps of the area. I'll need more than that to get what I want. Man, the controls are so much different than Dark Souls. Uh, hold to unlock. I should be getting my capture card in soon, so... Mario Sunshine with the waifu should begin shortly. It'll be fun. That was one of my favorite games when I was a kid. Assassin's rule number one. Always strike from behind. Especially when the fucker is twice your size. And remember to land on the carpet to make less noise. I can't leave this stiff lying around. That would be messy. Why can I hide it? Take these paddles off my controller so because I feel like I'm not gonna be using them. There we go. Duel with enemy. X to kill parry. Fight him. Gotta find the best move to counter his attacks. No. That's right. You can't. You can't uh, use your knife at all unless you're in combat. That was. That's one thing I hate when games do. It's like sometimes I just wanna, you know, swipe at the air. going I 
I'm at work, probably be on and off the stream. Oh, no problem, man. I appreciate you checking out the stream, dude. Hopefully work is going well for you. Hmm. Sand? A little spit? That could put that torch out from here. Still kind of busy. Oh, that's right. I never thought of it, but yeah, vape shops definitely make sense to have Black Friday deals. <clears throat> yeah, it was pretty relaxing. Yeah, hung out with both sides of the family. Yeah, it wasn't bad. How about you? I want to eat these mushrooms. <laughs> Don't mind me. Drop, hurry. Gotta get used to these controls. Glad to hear it. Yeah, it was honestly kind of like another day off for me. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Oh, he. You don't get iframes while killing. That's good to know. Or maybe I was just out of the iframes. <laughs> I thought he'd get like within an AOE distance or something like that and I'd be like, I'd be able to hit that kill button, but apparently not. <laughs> yeah, I remember combat is actually pretty All right. hard in this game. Let's keep going. That's why it's more beneficial to stealth, but, oh, that's right. I gotta hmm. sneak around. Sand, a little spit. That could put that torch out from here. I forgot I was supposed to sneak. What's the button to muffle kill? Oh boy, this is not a good start. <laughs> Uh, he is super short, um, but you are pretty much crouched all the... You manually crouch pretty much all the time to have uh, quieter footsteps. Because that's what I just did, is I was running instead of crouching, and that's what alerted the guys below. <laughs> yeah, we have a lot of learning to do. Got to get used to that parry timing. Hopefully Dark Souls taught me something about parry timing. We'll see. All right. Let's yep. keep going. But yeah, now he's not going to hear me. <laughs> Sand? A little spit? That could put that torch out from here. Whoa. I think when your tattoo glows up, you're like in total darkness or whatever it just lets you know they just don't mind torches going out huh yeah must happen all the time <laughs> but yeah you're definitely a small creature if he'll see me. Oh! <laughs> You're a blind, blind person. Oh. Oh boy, this is going to be a long playthrough. <laughs> That's okay. 
I won't stream it on all, I won't be streaming it on all of my stream days. Just occasionally. Till we make it through both. Yeah, a good thing they hired some dumb guards for this. Uh oh. Hey guys. More guards. <laughs> hey. Oh no. Oh, that's right. You're forced into combat if they see you. I forgot about that. This is not Dark Souls where you can just run through. <laughs> Oh man. <laughs> oh wow, there's a stealthy dwarf dude. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, it's right. it's more it's more stealth. Um but if you get seen Stand. by someone, it forces you to do combat with them. Torch out from here. And I think, I don't quite remember, but I think your only option is to parry them, then do a kill move on them. I I don't remember if you can just, like, slice them. And I gotta remember how to roll. I don't remember how to do that. So, how do I... What's the best way to get past these guys? I feel like the first time around was just luck. I just jumped over a couple barrels. Yeah, can can I throw more balls of spit dirt? Really? Really? Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's a good that's a good idea. See if I can get rid of more, some more torches. I wonder if I'm not doing it right. I remember I got pretty good at the game, so I just got to <laughs> got to remember how how I did things. All right. Let's keep going. Yeah, let's just extinguish more torches in this area. Hmm. Sand, a little spit. That could put that torch out from here. Got to Yeah, I got to get back to the rhythm, yep. Oh, those cannot be extinguished. Only these two. Really? Oh, see, he saw the torch go out. Because his line of vision was there. Okay. Yeah. I wonder if there's a way I can take one of these guys out. I know I can climb the wall over there, so maybe the, I'm supposed to go up. I think eventually you get like an ability where you can like grab them and pull them and then kill them. Oh, you know what? I might have figured out where I'm supposed to go. makes a little more sense. <laughs> and I was like, 
just jumping over those barrels seems kind of stupid, but... Okay. <laughs> Shit, more guards. If I stay hidden behind this barrel, it should Hold be fine. Hold RT, uh, RT to take cover. Okay. Wow, that guy's sick. <laughs> yeah, some arrow back. Alright, let's go under here. There's no way I can make it through there. Oh, really? This is my cover? Oh. I wonder if I'm able to do this. Oh my gosh, that's so funny. I'm going to try not to point out all the cheese in this game, otherwise I might end up not enjoying it. <laughs> uh oh, uh oh. Dang it. That's right, I think they can grab me. Like, if I was in front of him and he was triggered, I think he can pull me over. No, 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 no. No, see ya. No. No! <laughs> uh, <laughs> How do I roll? Let's figure that out right now. Oh, cool. I saved it right here. That's nice. Nope. You didn't see anything. I promise. Okay. Yeah, you gotta kind of like each room just figure out their pattern and then go from there. They're not going to come down the hallway. <laughs> oh, that's great. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I know. I gotta get they didn't come down the hallway. <laughs> yeah. That, that would straighten me out. Down there, maybe? Study these cocoons more closely. It would be fascinating. I think you can knock the, that broom over. A quick peek through the keyhole just to make sure the way is clear. Oh, and also I chose uh, normal mode instead of... There's four different modes you can choose from. I just wanted to play the game how it's kind of I gotta get supposed to My head is be played. Explode. But I think if you did the like hardest difficulty, it's like... Can't do that much cheese. Ooh. 
think Amber does power-ups. No, I did not go for the nightmare craziness. I'm like, it's been a while. <laughs> okay, LTA to create a, sl a, a clone. Okay, L... A. Possible to use. Create, create and control. It's cloned into areas. Da da da. Once clone has spread its purpose, you can destroy it. Recover amber. Life of a clone is short. Once their limit is reached, they die by themselves. LTA to create. Impossible to use right now. Now we're cloning things. Yep. It's one of his abilities. Well, I got no choice. I'll need some help. Okay, and then Y. Inter interact with Y. LTA. Rakash. I need your run carcass. Ugh. Damn it, I hate doing that. Yeah, that's not creepy at all. Let's see if I can... Oh, okay. That's right. They can take your clones out super quick. Right? Steal a body and do it yourself. Uh, hold. There we go. I'm not even angry about it dying, right? <laughs> Where do I put this? Enjoy your new home. Oh yeah, and I think if you extinguish the light in front of the guards, they'll actually just relight it. Let's see, amber vision. Ooh. So this shows me areas that you can use. So that showed me I could use that sewer thing. So, nope, they're not all slow, but <laughs> mostly slow. Yeah, it's cool ability so I think this guy is like oh this guy's like addicted to amber which is that stuff for the ability Yeah. It's part of the story. There's kind of a curveball that gets thrown at you. Oh, yeah, see, I did it right in front of the guard, so I think he'll go re-extinguish it. Nope. Okay. Maybe they'd do that more later on. <laughs> nah, it's fine. <laughs> Give me this ashen flask. I, oops. Yeah, you can knock stuff over and get in. People hear you. <laughs> Smooth. <laughs> Just knock over the stool. Okay, so there's a cupboard over there, so I can take one of them out and bring them over there. Yes, you were dreaming. And the the goblin that I am, it's kind of like an inf infestation. 
uh, in these castles. So it's, it's like, I'm like a rat to them. They just don't know that, like, I have a mind. Most of them are those weird, creepy creatures that I just cloned. So it, I don't know, it's kind of like a norm for them to see goblins. Ooh, what's this? I feel like I can climb on this. Yeah, it's, it's, there's a lot to this story. I usually skip cutscenes and all that kind of stuff for games, but this one, it's, it's pretty important to listen. Kind of get a familiar, familiarity with what's going on. Cause like I started this game and my character had a huge headache and didn't know where I was and stuff like that. So that gets, I'm basically, my character is trying to figure out where he's from and stuff like that. All he knows is that there's a friend that is, that's locked away. Yeah, I'm getting more into the story of games. Yeah. He's ki yeah, he's like waking up and like, what's going on? I don't want to ruin it in case you ever play it. Yay, my first victim. Where do we put you? You can sleep here. He's just drunk. <laughs> 